Hello everyone, uh, in this tutorial I am going to show you how can you make your AV3 robot move forward for number of rotations and then move backward for the same number of rotations. The first thing we have to do is to check the motors which are controlling the wheels are connecting to which port. When I connect the, my AV3 robot to my laptop or computer, I'll find that my wheels or the motors which controlling the wheels are connecting to A and B. So when I start coding, I have to make sure that I'm selecting port A and port B to move uh, the motors. The first thing, if you open the program, you will find that we need to go to movement blocks. I will go to movement because I want to control two motors at the same time. Okay, if I want to control one motor, then I will go to motors block. So when you click on movement blocks, you will find that we have many blocks uh, such as move forward for one rotation, like move straight for one rotation, and uh, we can say start moving. So if I want to move it forward for number of rotations, then I have to take a move forward block and place it below when program starts, move forward for one rotation. What we mean by rotation here is the wheel, like one rotation, my robot needs to complete a rotation to move for one rotation. Before we add this block, we need to set the movement to the motors, motor A and motor B, which are controlling the wheels. So I have to go to set movement, set movement, motors to, or we can we can take this one here, set movement motors B and C. I will change this one to A and B. Because here in the program I can see that A and B. So set movement motors to A and B. I want them to move forward for one rotation. One more thing I can add, if I want to set the speed, I want my robot to move with a speed 50%. My robot moved forward for, for one rotation. Now I want my robot to move backward for the same number of rotation. What we need to do is to change the direction from forward to backward and I will keep the number of rotation for one and let's run the program again. Okay. Now, what if I want my robot to move forward and then move backward? So what we can do, we can say, I'll stop the program. I want my robot to move backward. Sit movement first, sit movement motors to A and B, which are controlling the wheels and then move forward for number of rotation, which is one, and then we will set movement speed 50. Now, after we move forward, I can set the movement speed before. After we move forward for one rotation, we can make the robot to move backward. We will add the same block again, and then we will, instead of selecting forward, we will take backward, and then let's test the program now. Okay. What if I want my robot to wait for seconds, one second, between forward and backward? So I can go to control and then we will take the wait block so we can make the robot wait for a second before moving backward. Let's stop, play the program again. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how can you make your AV3 robot move forward and backward use move steering block. This is our previous tutorial. We used the robot, we used the block of moving forward to make it move forward. What if I want my robot to move forward, but a little bit more to the uh, right side or a little bit more to the left side? 
So in this case, I'm gonna like just get rid of this one. Uh, we will keep the first two blocks set movement motors to A and B and then we will set the speed to the motors which is 50% now I will go to move straight for one rotation so if I keep straight zero it will make my robot move forward straight in a straight line so I'm gonna play this one if I wanted to move backward again, I will add another move steering block, but this time I cannot I will keep the straight to zero, but I'm gonna change the rotation. And instead of making the rotation positive value so it will move forward, I will give it a negative value so it will go backward. So instead of make keeping this value one, I'll make it negative one to move backward let's just focus now okay so now my robot moved forward for one rotation backward for one rotation okay i want my robot to move a little bit with more like i can change like i want to make a circle or i want it to move forward but a little bit more to the right side so let's see how can we make this one i will change i will click on straight zero and i will click on changing the value like it's going to be right 70. let's try what's going to happen okay so my robot moved in a curved line okay to the right side with value 17 and then it goes it went backward uh, straight so i can okay i wanted to move uh, after going like forward uh, to the right side i wanted to go to the uh, left side so we will take left 17 and now I will change this because we want it to be forward. So I will keep it positive value. Let's test this program now. <laughs> 